When you start your new company, building a board of directors is what people often talk about in order to raise capital, in order to have good people involved in your company. Most people don't want to be involved in a brand new startup uh, as a board of director member because there's liability between the board member and the shareholders and perhaps other people. Uh, rather, what we do in a startup is we create a board of advisors. The advisors have no vote. They can sit on a, quote, board of advisors. They can get some stock for it. Usually we give them a quarter percent or half percent of stock, vesting over 12 to 18 months uh, just for being around for, to ask questions uh, that, for expertise that they bring to the table, and also using their resume as one of the resumes you present to your potential investors or potential strategic partners. So this board of advisors is an important piece of the puzzle to think about. At some point, if they're more involved, you can give them more stock. At some point, if they're more involved, you can put them on your board of directors, along with getting directors and officers liability insurance, which uh, is not inexpensive for a startup.